name is Mark Owens. I am 20 years old. I play a sixth bass for Atlanta Quest, and this is my first year in the ensemble, uh, although I did march Q2 last year, which is the open class version. Uh, I marched Atlanta CV when I was 15 in 2011 on snare drum. It's probably the greatest thing that's ever been done in the history of drum corps. Uh, if you haven't seen it, then you're really missing out. Uh, I also marched Second Bridge and did it percussion, which is also the greatest thing to be done at WGI, so I've pretty much taken over both activities at this point with, I don't want to say it'll never be topped, but it probably won't ever be uh, matched. So sorry to you if you weren't a part of it, um, that's just life. No, I also marched CV14 for a brief period of time in Carolina Crown uh, this past season as well, and I March Q2 last year. I'm, I'm also currently the percussion director at Hiram High School, um, where I teach full time, as well as the bass tech at Harrison High School. Uh, and previously, I've worked at Sequoia High School, um, East Paulding High School, and Paulding County High School for a little bit, of, a little bit of time. My favorite part about being in Atlanta Quest is that everyone genuinely gets along with each other. Uh, I know that there's a lot of ensembles where that doesn't happen, and I've even been a part of a few, and it's really refreshing to just be somewhere where people just genuinely like each other, and we have a lot of fun while simultaneously, you know, trying to be world class and do something that's worth seeing. My favorite baseline ever, and I've really thought about this, is Rhythm X 2014. I think that show musically is probably my favorite musically designed show of all time and the baseline really adds a lot to that. There's a lot of dynamic, uh, they play really 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 well uh, as far as just playing something that's readable and, and really contrasting and it's, it's really, I'm a huge fan. My favorite WGI show would be Rhythm X 2008 Gone. Uh, if you haven't seen that show, then I would suggest you immediately go and see it. Chino Hills kind of did a similar concept this last year with the uh, now you see me, now you don't sort of thing. Um, but they, the best part of the show, if you haven't seen it, is there's a ballad in which the entire battery is completely standing still and the pit hits a chord and then they're just like dead silent for 25 seconds and then they hit another chord and they're dead silent again and the attacks are literally perfect and it's, I don't know, it's just very, very, very effective because they're gone. Get it. Favorite warm-up, Gunt, because I get to hit the fattest note in the history of bass drum. It actually gives me tendonitis every single time I play it. Me and Didisi did this really stupid lick thing, and it somehow got featured on the Gridbook series. I feel it. Zach Marshall. There's no question there. It's, there's no doubt in my mind. Zaxby's. Or Waffle House. Chick-fil-A is pretty good too. Wendy's can be not bad. Taco Bell is also. I mean, I, I need to lose weight. I would be Parker Nice because Parker Nice is easily the only member of the baseline that consistently like does everything right and i wish i was like that well first of all everyone come in please come get in the shot just come just come in here and take a seat this is one of my students this is maddie everyone no. this is madeline whatever come here, cameron 
with another one of my students. This is Cameron. How's everyone doing? I have one more question left. What made me want to do Atlanta Quest? I know what made me want to do Atlanta Quest. Connor was doing Atlanta Quest. <laughs> well, he's not. So that's not it. But uh, I wanted to do Atlanta Quest because it helps me get better so that I can make these guys better. Yay! We're already perfect. Shut up. <laughs> You're not perfect. Hey! Quiet down out there. I'm trying to film something. <laughs>